So see our buyers, this is a good question. Question for Gary. Do you have a personal favorite memory of Clarence Clemens? Oh, geez. Uh, well, I've got a lot of memories of Clarence Clemens, kind of the best one being the first time I met him. Uh, he was, uh, Clarence Clemens was always Clarence Clemens. And I, at the time I was working with a, a band uh, down, downtown Long Branch, uh, New Jersey, a band called Little Melvin and the Invaders. And uh, we played at a, uh, a club just off Broadway in Long Branch called the Off Broadway. And I'd, I'd been working with Melvin for about six months. Uh, never rehearsed, never anything, just show up and do the gig. I even used his bass. I didn't even have to. He picked me up. I used his bass, his bass amp. All I had to do was just show up. Um, and then one night, the, uh, the sax player in the band didn't show up, and he sent a sub. And the, the, the sub was this guy named Clarence Clements. And that's when uh, he showed up. And, and it was really funny because Clarence was very concerned uh, about my welfare, and he wanted to take care of me and so that none of the people would mess with me. Um, I guess he, he didn't realize that I'd already been playing these black folks for like six months and, and there was never any problem. But, you know, he was just that kind of guy. And uh, so he took me under his wing and uh, I kind of never left there until, uh, until he passed away oh, 10 years ago. Um, he was just a one of a million guy and I miss him, miss him every day.